Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. Do you know that Moses Kuria is the most feared cabinet minister in the government of William Samoe Ruto? Just the other day, I read a certain news <laughs> that Amazon King directed senators to initiate the impeachment of Moses Kuria. And this was after some individuals, senators, came out hitting and attacking Moses Kuria as a cabinet minister who do not respect William Ruto as the president and members of parliament. I want to tell you today in this video that Moses Kuria is a man that is not terrified is a man that he, he always don't tolerate the government that he himself is inside. And again, he's the cabinet minister. And that is why in this video, I want us to have an inclusive analysis. An inclusive analysis. Why Moses Kuria? cannot be impeached, that is number one. Number two, why William Ruto cannot accept Moses Kuria to be impeached as the cabinet minister. But before we do that, ladies and gentlemen, if you are a visitor for the first time and you have not subscribed to this channel, please do me a favor, ensure you subscribe to this channel you like this video, give your opinion at the comment section below and don't forget to share this video. And again, in any case you want to communicate with me, you can WhatsApp me through the number 07 12 840 439. You can WhatsApp or you can call. That is WhatsApp and call only. And maybe you want to support this channel through a pesa or anything you want to do for this channel. You can also support this channel through the Mpesa number 07 59 95 01. I will appreciate you so much. Now, let us go back to the main business. Number one, the reason why Moses Kuria cannot be impeached. Despite of these statements that came from Samson Cherege, the senator of Nandi County, and Aaron Cheruyot, the senator of Kericho, coming out to initiate the impeachment motion through the Speaker of the Senate Assembly that they should initiate the impeachment motion to the National Assembly so that Moses Kuria can be impeached. Moses Kuria cannot be impeached, I'm telling you. And there's something that cannot be accepted by William Ruto himself. Why? Because Moses Kuria is a little force. Moses Kuria is a little force himself. And it will take just two days. Let me not even say two days. One day to destroy this government of William Ruto. As at the same time, William Ruto is destroying... The government, Moses Kuri is destroying the government, Enyeyeye ni cabinet minister. Siji kama muna nipata. Because the other day, he came out saying, enough is enough, we cannot complain and blame Uhuru Kenyatta. And we have the government, we have the instrument of powers, we have what to do with this government, at least to change and do whatever we promised Kenyans. We cannot waste a lot of our time just complaining and blaming Uhuru Mege Kenyatta. This was a message that was not well received by Kenya Kwanza led by William Samuel Ruto. The same same man came the other day saying that regarding Gashagwa was the genesis of him 
being transferred from, or reshuffled from the cabinet minister of industry or investment industry and trade and to be the cabinet minister of public service. Number three, Moses Kuria is a man behind defending some individuals whom are being attacked by either Rigadi Yashawa or William Ruto in the mountain. The same same Moses Kuria is a little force that in any case is going to unite with people like Maena Njenga, is going to unite with people like Mwagi Wairia, is going to unite with people like Mata Wangare Karua, is going to unite with people like William Kabogo from Kiambu, then the mountain is going to be a no-go zone for William Ruto. And that is something that they do understand. William Ruto understands that Moses Kuria is not an ordinary politician. He's a man that can do anything to destroy William Ruto in the mountain. Take it to the bank. You know, some people might think that Moses Kuria is just a simple man like that. Or rather, ni mutu wa kutupatupa maneno left, right, center. But siki ya leo, wafanya tu makosa waende wa impeach Moses Kuria. The way I've seen Amazon Kingi directing the senators to initiate an impeachment motion to the National Assembly so that they can impeach Moses Kuria because Moses Kuria does not have respect to the parliament, both the Senate and the National Assembly. Two, Moses Kuria does not have respect to William Samuel Ruto. Three, Moses Kuria does not have respect to the deputy president. Then four, Moses Kuria does not have respect to Kenya Kwanzaa Brigade. That is what they are saying. That is what they are saying. So for me, I don't think if these people can attempt doing that. And William Ruto himself will not accept. I know that. You know, Rigadi Gashagwa might come out to say that now, let us kick out Moses Kuria. But in reality, this might not be in good sense to William Ruto himself. You know, things are not good. Number two. The state of nation that we are now. William Ruto cannot accept Moses Kuria to be impeached. It will be easier for Moses Kuria to take all the weaknesses of this government na kuwa destroy once and for all. Because of the state, kind of state of um, kind of state of economy and also what William Ruto intended to do but he has not actualized them. It is easier for Moses Kuria to come out and to destroy William Ruto. It is easier. It will just take him some hours. Na maneno kutakuwa kimayaribika kona yote ya mzima ya Kenya. And you people, I want to tell you today, kuna some individuals William Ruto awezi fire. He cannot. And as our transfer to from this place to the other. Yes. But they cannot fire Moses Kuria and some individuals in Kenya kwa the government. They know it. They know it. And this is just a dangerous act that these members of parliament can come out and impeach Moses Kuri. And by the way, Azimio will assist the Kenya Kwanzaa MPs to impeach Moses Kuri so that they can see the dire consequence that this Kenya Kwanzaa they are going to see. And in a matter of fact, as times goes by, I believe this is something that is going to be reversed. And I know even MPs will be summoned and they will be told a kind of big mistake that you'll make is to impeach this man Moses Kuria. They will be told. They will be told. And if you want to make our government to be in crisis, impeach Moses Kuria. Ladies and gentlemen, what do you think? 
drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, I want to appreciate you so much because of your support. Please consider subscribing, liking, commenting, and sharing this video.